Hey guys, uh, so today I want to talk about my Egg Rider um, display upgrade that I got for my BVS HD. I went from the C965 display and I went with the Egg Rider. It was about 100 bucks from EM3 EV. And let's see. So you can see here it is. It's really small, way smaller than the old display that I had on there. So you can see it is way smaller. This is the C965 display. And uh, all right, so I'm gonna go really quick on what all this is. So it'll tell you exactly what your voltage is and it's accurate, which is really nice because that one couldn't tell you. It was only made for a 48 volt battery and I always run 52 volts so it would never tell you anything. Um, so this is actually accurate. So it says 56.1 and it'll tell you the percentage left you input um, your battery capacity in the app. Um, there's actually two different modes, uh, road and off-road. I'll get more on that later. Uh, your speed, how much watt hours are left in your battery, uh, pedal assist levels here. Um, and then right underneath it here, I have it programmed. It'll tell me in real time my watt hours per mile, which is awesome. So you don't have to, I used to always do the math in my head. Like I divide the watts by my speed and that would give you your watt hours per mile. This one tells you exactly what it is. The only thing that sucks is this display is so small that it's hard to kind of read that. But the good news is it comes with an app for your phone and then I mount it right here and it tells you in much bigger, uh, yeah, you can see here. Uh, it'll tell you efficiency right here, your watts, your total watts that you're pulling, your trip time, distance. So the, the phone app is actually way more uh, in-depth. It'll tell you a lot more. Um, it'll also tell you the time, time of day right now. It's a clock and a trip meter. And if you press and hold down the menu button, it gives you a snapshot of Everything it has the odometer on it, um, the stats from your last trip, um, which is nice. So really quick, why I really like, I'll give you plus and pros and cons of, of this display. Pros, you could program your controller from your phone for the BBS HD, which is ama amazing. It's insane. You don't have to plug it into a computer anymore, run a cable, disconnect any cables. You could do it from your phone. Like that. So if you're doing a ride and you're like, oh, you know what? Pedal Assist 1 is giving me too much power, which I actually have that a lot. Sometimes I like my Pedal Assist 1 to just be a little bit, just give me a little bump. I, li I like to do a lot of the power myself. I'm going for total efficiency. So if you could fine tune it on your ride and you could actually do two different versions. So there's road and off-road. So I may program road to be my efficiency settings and then off-road is if I'm in a hurry and I'm trying to get somewhere and I want it to be quick so I could have this thing essentially has two different lives which is awesome um, one thing I there's a small pet peeve one thing I don't like about it is that it is very small so it's hard to read that information on here you could read your speed and your pedal assist level which is 90% of all you really need um, but all the, the other little stuff like the watt hours per mile Sometimes I have to like squint and look down on it and I'm taking my eyes off the road. But a lot of that can be solved if you just take this and mount it somewhere on your phone and you could just, or on your bike and you could just, just see that stuff in real time. Um, one other thing is it doesn't have a temperature gauge on there. Boo hoo, kind of sucks, but oh well. Overall, like all the things this thing does do is awesome and they're always releasing updates to it. I've already. I've seen that you've uh, they've released about five updates to this in like the last year that they've they've had it out, and I'm sure they're just going to keep updating it and making improvements to it, um, which is pretty cool. So far, I'm a fan of this. Is it worth a hundred bucks? If you're a if you're a rider like I am, I put on like four thousand miles a year on my bike. Uh, it's worth it. I like to know what's going on with my watt hours per mile. So if you are Two, get this thing. If you're at all like a little stat nerd or something, get this get this display. Uh, it's it's easily worth it. Or just being able to program it on the fly is worth it. So, all right, guys. 
Thanks.